Here we go. Two in a row. Stages men, 3 0. Livingston did approximately hee haw. Second time having to cover this game. Thankfully, there was plenty of action to talk about. Well, there actually wasn't. Like, not a lot of fucking happened until like 12 minutes to go. Uh, Livingston, since that 14 game on beating run last season, they've been pretty, they've been pretty shite like. So, I mean, Martindale, we, we may have been talking about this if he's it's, it's, it's the next great hope like, but I mean, no, in this performance, definitely not. So, Rangers take the lead through Hadji, I mean, can't finish. He had an opportunity to strike it straight away, decided not to, trapped it with his uh, foot, turned his body around, sent a couple of limbs and defenders the way. Chris Morton esque, smashed it into the top of the net. Simple as that, really. Then not a lot happened. Once Joe Rebo got, got forced a good save. Yeah, it was actually pretty impressive. Joe Rebo chests the ball down, controls it. He uh, didn't really connect as sweetly as he wanted. But the goalkeeper, was it Strayek? I thought he had a good game today. Oh, I actually played. Didn't have many saves to make, but he, did make, he made a couple of decent ones. Um, Sakala constantly getting caught offside wasn't too good. I was pretty pish. I mean, this, see when Livingston went behind, you, just, you knew they weren't going to score it. This game was shit. It really was. Good seeing fans back. Uh, good seeing fans back. Like, Should be full capacity. Even, even if it was a fucking bunch of dull munchers, like, you know what I mean? Oh, brother, the hell testify. What? But, um, you know, it's like, fuck it. Uh, the, I think the game would have been, well, I say obviously, but maybe if Livingston went 1 0 up, the game would have been more interesting. Oh, well. But, I mean, Rangers went 1 0 up and Livingston couldn't even get in the Rangers box, so what chance? The game was over. The game was dead within seven minutes. You're damn right. And then Hadji got injured, which was a brutal. Uh, it was a brutal tackle, big man. It pretty much became a case of, well, are Rangers going to win 1 0, or are they going to win 2 0, or 3 0, or 4 0, or 5 0, or 6 0? Uh, Rangers right. weren't even that good, but they won 3 0. They weren't, they, but I mean, Livingston were just. Were Livingston shite, or were Rangers good in the sense that they never let Livingston create anything? I'm going to go with Livingston, were pretty shite today, I think they were. Right. Uh, pretty poor game in general. Scott Wright got the second. I don't know if he meant it or not. It looked like he was just trying to swing a, his leg at the ball to try and. Well, yep. But he ends up scoring. So. Right, I'll give him the benefit of the doubt because he's second place to Lewis Ferguson. Right. Don't know what logic that is. And then Kamar Ruth made it free. Um, in the, none of the Livingston defenders wanted to clear the ball for some reason. They had over 2.5, I think. Yeah, I think they had 2.5 goals. And Kamar Ruth looked at it and looked at it. And he, he, he looked around the box and he was willing to give the Livy players a chance to clear it. And he was generous, he must have waited about 20 seconds, but there was no takers and he went, you know what, fuck it, I'll just make it free. Bangs it in. 3-0. Good Job night. Done. Rangers, top of the league. Will they remain there for the, for the rest of the season? I mean, you could make a case for it, I mean, they could. Unless Hearts beat Celtic 4-0 and 8, then Hearts could go top, but... Uh, Very true. You know, um, as for Rangers, job done. Good night. Move on to Tuesday night now. Oh, Malmo. Um, I'm going to pump Malmo. I'd be surprised if Rangers don't comfortably get past Malmo, but you never know. You never do know. And away goals are scrapped, by the way. Don't know if that helps. Well, didn't it help Celtic, did it? Nothing helps Celtic. No. Nope. Yeah. Apart from the police getting Lee Griffiths off, but until next time. Oh, hey, is that really a help at the moment? Fuck me, Lee Griffiths. You're, you're doomed with or without him. Well, as it Foster Gogley said, Griffiths needs to win over fans. I think you need to win over fans, mate. You're fucking shit. That, that, that's no. true, but. What, what kind of guy that talks to kids really do to win over fans, apart from convert people and touching kids? So, like, see if Adam Johnson returned and, and scored a goal, would he have been a fucking, would he have been a, uh, a Sunderland hero? I know. I mean, like, fuck me. It's one thing something he tweet it, but, like, I mean, he's I not well, the kids. Well, 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 big job now, but he basically got away with it because he was successful. Well, you're supposed to show you, 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 you it's Celtic Park, you can touch kids as long as you're winning trophies. Those two free kicks were good, Lee, but... Touching kids, that's not my cup of tea, big man. Oh no, it's Celtic, as long as you're touching trophies, you're allowed to touch the kids as well. But so until then, peace.